What is up, everybody? Good morning, good day to you. Um, it's about 12 o'clock on Wednesday, and I'm at work right now, obviously. But, um, yeah, so sorry about the videos lately again. I, I'm not going to apologize anymore because these are the videos that I'm doing. Um, you guys still like them. We get, what, two nights out of the week where I'll pop something open or give you guys, give you code cards every video except for last night. Um, yeah, but by the way, I'm waiting on it. Waiting on a ton of stuff to come in the mail. So once that comes in, we're going to be opening up a Legends Johto pin collection box. And, uh, sorry bunch of loose cards I'm going I'm gonna answer this message real quick I think Saturday I was about to drive an hour and a half to go buy 1500 cards for 60 bucks and I just told the guy last night that I would drive there Saturday and last night before I went to bed I noticed he said he marked it sold so I was like cool you know he marked it sold for me and today I asked him if I could still meet him on Saturday and he said no he sold them so literally after I told him I was coming to get them Saturday, he sold them. So that's not cool. Not good business. But could have told me somebody else was interested. But anyway, um, the kid that I bought the stuff in the shoebox full of Pokemon cards actually has a binder full of Pokemon cards. So I will be meeting him Saturday or possibly Friday after work. Depends on what I want to do. Maybe I'll do it Friday so I don't have to go out Saturday. But... Um, I don't know. I'll talk to you guys on my lunch more about what's going on in the next couple of days. Um, what I have going on, you know. Um, I sold four packs of Hidden Fates for $60 on eBay. One person paid, the other person didn't. I sold the Tops cards that I had. Tops Pokemon cards. Um, that person did just pay. And I have a couple extra I'm going to throw in. So I'll leave them a note and tell them that I found some extra ones. Here, that or I'll list those. Um, yeah. I'm going to go to Target after work and see if I can find any Pokemon stuff. I've been really hurting on the Pokemon stuff. I did just buy... Hmm. The guy never answered me back about the Shining... Uh, Shining Star V box that I bought. I really hope I'm not getting an empty box because I'm going to be pissed. Real pissed if I spend $50 on an empty box. But if it's full... Um, if he answers me and tells me it's full, I'm going to order two more. They're going for 130 right now. Why would I not pay $50 for a box? Um, even the Korean ones, the cheap ones. Korean are the cheapest version of the cards that you can buy. But they still have the same cards. Still the same quality, same everything. Um, those, I think those are going for like 87 So just to show you that they're, they're still holding their value. Um, I think Leonhart just posted that he's going to be opening a something Shining Fates preview tonight or tomorrow. I'll talk to you guys in a little bit. <laughs> What's up, guys? Sorry, this looks funny. Okay. I'm officially putting it out there. Real breaking, Nate. We're going to have a challenge. I'm calling you out because I feel like every time I make a video and I tell people where to find Pokemon cards... You put the same exact video out a week later, or a couple days later. I don't understand it. Um, now last week I said, my mom was coming back from uh, up north, the cabin that they have up north, and I asked her she's to call Cracker Barrel. Cracker Barrel sells Pokemon cards. Now I just put that in my video last week. How does Real Breaking Nate make a video that says Cracker Barrel sells Pokemon cards. I don't get it. It's crazy. So this is a challenge for this weekend. I'm not sure what I have going on. But I'm canceling all that. I'm canceling everything. This weekend, I'm making a challenge video for Real Breaking Nate. Which he ain't gonna reply. He ain't gonna respond. I've sent him messages on uh, Instagram. I've sent him messages on Twitter. He never replies to me. I'm a low man on the totem pole. And I'm real. So that's why he ain't gonna answer me. He's just gonna answer some fanboy that wants some free cards. I don't need free cards. I don't need nothing. I'm gonna make a video. 
Saturday and Sunday. I'm going to drive around and I'm going to spend $500. Okay, Nate? $500. No questions asked. I don't even have $500 to spend on Pokemon. But I just want to prove to everybody all the stores that Nate is putting up on his Pokemon channel are coming off of my videos. It's getting... You know, at first it was okay. I said, that's cool. You know, this guy, this guy's making videos and it seems like he's doing the same thing I am. And then it got to the point where every week I was putting videos up. And the following week, Nate was putting his videos up. Now, call it a, there's a million people doing videos, but not a million people doing videos about where to find stuff, where to find Pokemon cards. Um, to my fans, I just want to apologize for the statements that I said and apologize to nobody. Psych. Um, not apologizing for nothing I say. Uh, you just sorry. Yeah, yeah. You know, I was going to say if you don't like it, that sucks. But I'm sorry to the people that heard me say some foul language. And that I will say I, I am sorry for. But it's very frustrating when I make videos and I'm the low guy on the totem pole. And I have people tell me they love my videos, and I can see that people love my videos because my subscribers started. It might not seem like a lot, but it's only been two months, okay? Started at 40 and jumped up to 76, 75, whatever it is. So people are watching, people are liking, so I appreciate all you guys. So just so you know, you can actually, uh, you know, if Nate does videos, uh, he's been doing it for years. And um, to show that. I'm making videos and he's doing the same thing a week later or a couple days later after I post my videos. It's just showing me that he's run out of stuff to do and run out of stuff to think about. So in three years or however many years he said he's been doing Pokemon cards, he should have done these videos already. He should have had these videos out already. If um, I did them, if I've only been doing it for two or three months now, um, I've got my videos up. And I'm sure I'm going to think of a lot more things to do with the Pokemon cards besides do uh, fan mail and crap like that and copy other people's swag. So stay tuned for tonight's video. I finally found stuff here at Target. What's up squad? So I'm at Dollar General right now. I just picked up three Champions Path Hatina V boxes and one Alakazam V box. And um, yeah, I'm pretty happy because I haven't found any Pokemon stuff. I was actually going to buy all of the, <laughs> the Champions Path stuff, but I couldn't. I couldn't do that. And the Alakazam V box. I wanted to grab like three of them, but I'm not a big fan of Vivid Voltage, so... That's basically for my one and one of my personal collection. The other two I'm going to sell to get my money back. And uh, I'm not trying to sell them for $30. I'm just trying to get $20 each to get my money back. I just like being able to continue to ship stuff. So if I pay $20, I need to make like $25 total. What is up? I haven't done one of these in a minute. So unstable. Oh, oh my god, I just wagged myself in the nuts. Oh, the, the pain, the agony. Twenty of these. What's up, fellas, ladies, gents, kids, girls, boys? First time I opened Champion's Path, I pulled a Charizard out of a Marnie box. 
and I haven't pulled any cards. Oh, look at the color difference on that card. Yo, bro. I just saw something. I don't know what it was. Sizzlepeed. Purloin. Scraggy. Pokeball. Nugget. What did I do? Galarian Zigzagoon. Oh, wow. I messed this up, like, bad. I don't even know. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Eight. Wow, Sharpedo. What is going on right now? Piers? Lycanroc? Wow, what did I do? I don't know what I just did. I'm confused myself. Hmm. Throw that there. Whoa. This one got... What am I doing? I'm like confusing myself here. One, two, three. To the... Front. Whatever. Sharpedo. Arbok. Kabu. Inkjay. Pokeball. Sizzlepeed. Galarian Zigzagoon. Scraggy. Weedle. Centiscorch. Did they always put energy cards? Why do I not remember that? What am I going to get? A Centiscorch, a Lycanroc, a Marnie, and... Hmm. Let's guess it. Three and throw the energy. Energy! Pokemon Center Lady. Stadium. Hop. Full Heal. Perleon. Cocoon. Hot Darren. Trubbish. Really? You guys are doing reprints and you put two Lycan Rocks in one box. Let me guess, there's going to be a Marnie in here, right? I'm just upset at this point. Oh, by the way, bought this. Got this today. E-Reader Charizard. E-Series. Sonya. Beedrill. Milo. Pokeball. Inkay. Clarence is zoom. Yo, bro. Are you kidding me right now? So... Hmm. Hmm. So we just got two legging rocks and two center scorches. Hmm. Wow. That was a complete waste. Hmm. 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 You guys, you know what? I don't even know what I do with my sleeves. Like, I literally just got sleeves. Sleeves? Are you in here? Hello? Hello? Have you seen my sleeves?
Why am I having like such a brain fart right now? I have no idea where my sleeves went. Mm. I had bought Evie sleeves. Did I like throw them away by accident? That's empty. I have hidden fate sleeves. You guys gotta get taken out of these. You are not worthy. Okay, let's try this again. If anybody wants these, I will sign one for you if you want, or I could just send you one. Because, like, now I have two new ones, but I have more down here. Okay, so now we have a different card. Wow, I just saw something very shiny. Very shiny. This is the code card. This is something shiny in here. Maybe it's a... Maybe it's a... Look, I can see it. Whoa. Let's just cut to the chase. Card of RV. That's worthy. Hmm, nice looking card. Centering is way off. I think we have that already. I'll have to double check. I'm gonna double check all these cards actually, so. Was this, was this the, the box to buy? I should have left all the other ones there. Fighting, Kabu, Arzal, Beedrill, Kakuna, Rockruff, Bullpix, Reverse Hollow Energy, and up. Ooh, Scrafty Hollow. I don't think I have that. You are worthy. This was the box. Eh. Eh. This was the box, ladies and gentlemen. Energy, Triple Stadium, Leopard, Beady, Kakuna, Roly Coley, Trubbish, Potion, Machamp, Marnie. I, like, that should be the whole set. I thought this was the box to buy, ladies and gentlemen. Energy, Rotom Bike, Hyper Potion, Sharpedo, Hatana, Kakuna, Rock Rock. 
Vulpix Potion, Hyper Potion. But they, they just can't go without putting two rares in the same box, huh? Oh my goodness. What is this nonsense they're pulling? Pokemon, you need to step your game up. Oh, I'm sorry. Did I say I was done? Nah. Since we haven't opened up anything on this channel recently. Why is what? Whoa, 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 chair. Make it worth it. You know what? That, that one's going to somebody. Dreadnought. This is it. This is the pack that I saw. See right through it. And there's a Charizard inside. And... I saw it. It's the Charizard. He's right here. Rotom Phone, Malmar, Stadium, Athena, Full Heel, Scraggy, Ba 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 Ba, Hatiana, Marnie, another Marnie. What is this gonna have? Lycan Rock in it too? I'm just getting frustrated with these packs. <clears throat> they want to do reprints. Hello, Jessica. We're just cutting to the chase. Oh my gosh. Scrafty, you gotta go. Sorry, I need you. Ah, you know what? I think I have the Dreadnought VMAX. Yep. I'm pretty sure I do. What are you doing? Jessica. number is that 15 Jesse get that out of your mouth babe there he is dreadnought v max hmm this is awesome that I don't have any sleeves Okay, so that's a double. What about Scrafty? Number 42. Oh no, I got him too. Oh, somebody, I need to send out these code cards, these codes, because... They're just falling over. Whoa, whoa. Wait, whoa, whoa. Um, I have Nicky, I have Marnie. Number 18. Sorry. Out of ours, number seventy. Oh, I don't have you. All right, let's get back to it. Two more packs. I'm just gonna rip them open at this point because I don't even care. Pro 
Loyline, Loyline, hot tuna. Yo, bro. Ekans, a whale lord V. I think we have that one too. Number 13. I honestly think I just, just put that in. Yep, just put that in there. What about Ekans? Yep. You ain't telling me nothing I don't already know. I know my sets. That's why they're mine. Not like all you other people that want to sell cards on eBay and don't know which cards you actually have in your set. Bum, 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 bum. Like in rock and a Zygarde. That's it. 28 and 30. Let's check it out, guys. Um, Lycan Rock Reverse Hollow is right here. And Zygarde's right there. So basically, I had every single one of these cards. I doubt there's one card in this whole thing that I got today that I didn't have. I know I have those. I know I have that. I know I have that. Oh my gosh, my kid's drinking coffee. You drinking coffee, Jess? Since when? When do you drink coffee? Alright guys. That was the champion path opening tonight. Not bad. You drinking coffee? Are you even old enough to drink coffee? Oh, I'm sorry, did I say I was done? flipped over you know what that means I'm saving it for one lucky person that leaves a comment and tonight's video will get the Zalakazam code card we got Rebel Clash we got Sun and Moon we got Vivid Voltage I don't have this and I don't have that I'm just gonna go with that. Show you this real quick. Oh yeah, here's another one. Put that there. Oh, we're falling down. This is a special binder that was custom made by some company. I don't know who. Don't care. I got it from a hotel. I lied. I didn't get it from a hotel. I'll fix that later. I think it's cool. Let's crack some vivid voltage. Why not? Fire! Telescopic Sight, Federal Goat, Seed It, Fanfi, Super 
Regina, Voltorb, boom, reverse hollow Zekrom, and a Lycanroc. Would you imagine that? Dewart, Opal, Matang, Skiddo, Pharisee, Dedini, Drober, Ashawat, Galarian Stump, Bro. Bro. We just got a Rainbow Rare Opal. Treadnought. No, nah, Wailard. Wailard, I'm so sorry, bud. Ta -da! It's a little off-centered. I can't believe I just pulled a rainbow rare. Putting those up there for right now because I just sold two packs and I need to replace them. That is awesome. I wasn't even going to open the Vivid Voltage. You know what? From now on I should just open every pack because I bought a Sword and Shield dollar store pack and I sold it to somebody I literally bought one pack and the dude pulled a gold Zacian remember whoever comments in tonight's video first person to comment will get this Alakazam V-Box code card and I really want to open these Hidden Fates packs but I'm waiting for payment on one if the guy doesn't pay and the other two don't sell, I will open them. Yeah, my word. Now, how crazy it would have been if I just opened up all this stuff and I didn't hit the record button. Thanks for watching tonight's video. I appreciate you guys. Um, yeah, I said some mean stuff about Real Breaking Nate earlier, but I just, I don't know. It just really bugs me. Went to Target tonight. Went to Rite Aid. They had their stuff all locked up. Like, you can't even get it without asking somebody for help. I also have this I still need to open up. I bought it because it says there's two Charizards in it. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. I really want to start buying the theme decks with the Cracked Ice promos. But, uh, yeah, we'll see. Thanks for watching. Peace.